Hello, Soul Healers, and welcome now to Tuesday, and thanks for logging in. Well, it's going to be cloudy. You're going to be thrown into the professional world today, but it looks like there's going to be a major breakdown when it comes to marriages and partnerships. So to start off, the moon in Gemini does keep your heart sensitive at work. So the trigger may be at work. You're sensitive at work. You're sensitive in your profession today. So it could be a little comment the boss says, a little comment a coworker says. Could be, uh, it could actually be vented. You might end up wanting to vent on someone at work, so don't do that. Sometimes we tend to project our own issues. But something in your work or profession may actually be a trigger just because that's where you're sensitive. That, however, is not the lesson. We're in chapter one of Sun in Pisces, and Uranus is ruling the day. Uranus is the big bad wolf of the solar system. It huffs and it puffs. Anything built out of straw gets blown down. And the lesson is, of course, that we did not build that very strongly. Okay, is that a word, strongly? Yes. So that said, remember, the most important relationship, the one that you will truly be in till death do you part, is the one to yourself. It's very likely, no matter where the issue or breakdown is, even if there's a breakdown in the marriage, did you really stand up for yourself when you married that guy, right? I mean, that's kind of what it comes down to. So even if someone in your partnerships lets you down today, how did you let yourself down in the first place with all this? Just keep that in mind to keep a good perspective, because that's where we're going really with this transit, is you treating yourself better. You will draw in a person that treats you like you secretly treat yourself. However, there will be a breakdown today. It may be a marital fight. It may be one of those days where you just start crying and saying, I'm never going to get married. I'm never going to find this person. And what's amplifying all this is Jupiter. Watch the zodiac weather. But the sun and Jupiter are conjuncting. So Jupiter is adding drama, adding expansion, adding all kinds of cast of characters in the situation. So yes, it is much more intense than it is usually during this time of the year. But we're going to learn, and Jupiter at the end of the day is going to offer as many band-aids as it does uh, bad things. I can't think of a good analogy there. All right, that's all I have for Tuesday. Everything lines up tomorrow, so just hang in there, Virgo, and I'll see you then. Live, love, be. So garden.